more often than not, even the most complex-looking gradient-based designs in Illustrator are quite easy to create. And you can get impressive results by using a clever combination of Illustrator's basic tools and looking beyond their obvious functionality. Hey guys, I'm Evgenia Regini Brand, a graphic designer at Attitude Creative and a gradient fanatic. I teach a popular Skillshare class on mastering gradients in Illustrator and have an ongoing gradient studies series, which is my personal pursuit exploring different techniques for creating vector gradient-based designs by exploiting the full potential of Illustrator's tools. I am often asked how I have created certain pieces in my gradient studies series. And in this class, I am excited to dissect for you a selection of designs which feature some of my favorite tricks and techniques and share a few tips and ideas for how you can use a combination of Illustrator's tools in your future project to create exciting works easier and faster. This class is designed for intermediate and advanced Illustrator users who know their way around the program well and are proficient users of Illustrator's core tools and functionality, including clipping and opacity masks, blend tool, appearance attributes, and effects. Whether you're an illustrator, graphic artist, or designer who needs to quickly visualize concepts to pitch ideas to clients or an in-house team, or create final works for print or digital use, I hope this class will spark some new visual ideas and help you create eye-catching designs more efficiently. So, let's dive right in! <music> 